Welcome to Your Kentucky Lawn. In this episode, we're going to talk about organic fertilizers. Organic gardening seems to be a popular buzz phrase these days, but what exactly does it mean? We tend to think of the word organic as healthier food or something that's better for the environment. By definition, the word organic simply means containing carbon. Many things on earth, including us, contain carbon. To say I'm going to use an organic fertilizer may mean using one that may be less detrimental to the environment, but it may mean using something that is not great for the environment that happens to contain carbon. So how are you supposed to know? Try to think of natural when it comes to these fertilizers. Technically, a fertilizer has to feed soil microorganisms to be considered organic. Products such as manures, poultry litters are good choices, sewage sludge is an option, compost and animal byproducts will also work. These products have all been naturally processed so are safe for you to handle. There are a lot of organic fertilizers available on the market so if you're not sure if a product is natural or not contact the company or contact your county agent for clarification. The thing to pay attention to with organic fertilizers is that the nitrogen content of these products, the first number shown on the bag of fertilizer, is often quite low. On the one hand, this is a good thing. Because this number is low, the chance of seeing fertilizer burn on your lawn is also quite low. On the other hand, to get the amounts of fertilizer needed to put out the required amount of nitrogen to an actively growing lawn can get pretty high. This means you're going to have to buy quite a lot of product to get the desired level of nitrogen. If you want to help your pocketbook out some, your cheapest source of organic fertilizer is to not bag your clippings when you mow. You can provide up to 25% of your lawn's yearly fertility needs just by not bagging. One important point to note is that you don't have to use organic fertilizers to have an environmentally friendly yard. Synthetic fertilizers such as ammonium nitrate or urea can be safe for the environment when used properly. We will discuss proper fertilization techniques in a future episode. Because organic fertilizers must be processed by microorganisms in the soil, they take some time to become available to the plant. These are termed slow release fertilizers and will release small amounts of nutrients to the plant over a couple of months or more. One nice thing about using slow release fertilizers is that because you don't have a whole lot of fertilizer being released at one time, you don't get a flush of growth after application that you're going to have to remove by mowing. Also, because there is only a little fertilizer released at a time, you minimize the likelihood of losing vast quantities of nutrients to runoff or leaching through the soil after a big rain. Another environmental advantage. To me, the greatest benefit of organic fertilizers in terms of the environment is that they will actually improve your soil over time. As these fertilizers are added to a soil, they increase the organic matter content, which further increases nutrient retention. Organic matter will also improve water holding capacity, which allows you to run your sprinklers just a little less often. Finally, because a lot of these products are animal byproducts or wastes, do they smell bad? I'd like to tell you they all smell just like roses, but they don't. Some of them don't have much of a smell at all, while others, um, yeah. I've actually heard of a homeowners association that banned organic fertilizers because of the smell. If this is a concern of yours, talk to your local garden center about this and find one that meets your aromatic needs. In summary, organic fertilizers work as slow release fertilizers and will improve your soil over time. Organic fertilizers typically do not cause fertilizer burn. Disadvantages include cost, ease of handling, and potential odor. And remember, just because you use a synthetic fertilizer source does not mean you are harming the environment. By choosing the right fertilizer sources, and by applying the products properly, your lawn and the environment will thank you. I'm Greg Munshaw and this is Your Kentucky Lawn.